Uh, for Africa, uh, we see really uh, from our vantage point two main areas in which natural resource sector could be leveraged better to contribute to uh, sustainably improved living standards, but has fallen short. Uh, the first area is it as a vital source of uh, resources for financing sustainable development uh, goals and agendas in general, right? Because there's this uh, shortage of uh, sustainable financing and we think that uh, strengthening government and natural resources can mobilize additional revenues for Africa to be able to finance its uh, uh, economic development, particularly in a context where um, the, the overseas development assistance outlook is uh, increasingly uncertain. Um, yet, as uh, NRGI have reported, uh, Africa and African countries, you no know, African country has a good rating in natural resource governance, and only Ghana and Botswana have satisfactory ratings all other countries have weak or poor ratings. And seven of the world's uh, bottom 10 performers with failing governance uh, scores are in Africa. So we've got to change that. The, encouragingly, we have seen some uh, welcome progress on the continent uh, with countries including Ghana uh, and Guinea stepping up efforts to strengthen governance uh, in their countries. And we were uh, quite honored to have uh, Last, uh, last month, the president of Guinea, Alpha Conde, um, who kind of shared with us the, uh, the experience of uh, Guinea and the reform they've undertaken and uh, what sort of uh, early payoff they've been seeing. And we have with us the ambassador from Guinea, who you would also hear from uh, later on. And the second area for us has been how do we design policies for natural resource management in a way that they aligned much better with uh, overall structural transformation uh, agendas and is able to contribute more to job creation and poverty uh, alleviation. Uh, so we've been undertaking some work through our colleague John Page and uh, other experts, and they are completing a project looking precisely at uh, recent discoveries in oil and gas in Ghana, Mozambique, Tanzania, Uganda, and Zambia, exploring how to avoid policy mistakes of the past so that the discoveries can contribute uh, better to structural transformation. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos from Brookings.